Hey guys, Garage Max out here. Uh, today we are going to be disabling the double honk on an F-150. Uh, if you have one of these Ford vehicles, you're very familiar. You have your uh, wireless key. You go in, you start your truck, and then you go out leaving the truck running. And as soon as you shut the door, it gives a really loud double honk. Uh, super annoying and uh, the way they've got it timed is right when you get to the front of the truck it honks So we're gonna go ahead and get rid of that uh, You are going to need an OBD2 to USB or wireless adapter uh, as well as a Foreskin tool or similar So we're gonna go ahead and dig in I'm gonna show you the adapter that I got as well as Foreskin And then we'll go ahead and uh, just change the hex values to get this uh, dis disabled. Let's go check it out. Okay, so I am using the OBD Link EX. Uh, I'll put the Amazon link in there. I'm using the USB one uh, just because I've used Bluetooth ones before and uh, sometimes they're real finicky. So I went ahead and got the USB one. Uh, you'll get this cable and then you'll just plug it in to the port right underneath, right here. Okay, once you've got it hooked up here, uh, you're going to leave your foot off of the uh, brake. You're going to plug it into your computer. And then you've got your key, but you're going to leave your foot off the brake. You're going to go ahead and uh, push the start button. And that's going to put it into accessory mode. And now we'll take a look at the computer screen itself so you can see what we're doing uh, from a programming standpoint. Okay, so I'm gonna include the link to Forescan, which is a tool that you're gonna use to make these hex edits. Uh, and you're, you're likely gonna need to do two things. Uh, one, when you plug in your USB cord, it's going to ask you for a driver. I'll include the link to the driver in the description below. The second is to do this task to write to the, to the truck, uh, you are gonna need the extended license uh, and I'll include the instructions on how to do the extended license as well. So essentially this program is free. They offer you an extended license free for two months. Um, so it's very easy, there's no costs involved. Uh, however, you are gonna have to go through those two steps. Once you've got the extended license on here, then the truck is gonna connect to the software itself and I'll show you which entry we've gotta change. Okay, so you're gonna navigate to this section right here and then you're gonna see all the different modules that are in there and you're gonna to go to the BDY CM as built and you're gonna go ahead and open that up hit the play button yep. just hit okay to the 72641 section and then for the O2 value you're going to change the first box from 0001 to 0000 and then you're going to change the last box to have a 2 in the last digit okay. and you're going to go ahead and hit right. cycle the truck off and then back on. Okay, and we'll go ahead and shut it off again. And we'll go ahead and try it. Go. No hunk. Okay guys, uh, so I hope this was helpful for some folks. Uh, it's a relatively simple change. Uh, if your vehicle is not an F-150, there may be some slight differences in what hex values you modify. Feel free to reach out in the comments and I'll try and respond to any uh, that, that I know about uh, and help you guys out. Uh, but please like, subscribe, ring the bell, and thanks for watching.